Good evening, Clary, and I'm Matt Catrillo with your Wednesday night sports report. The Golden Eagles women's basketball team opened up their season last night at home against Tiffin. The first half was evenly matched with the Golden Eagles up 15-13 with 6.36 left in the first half. Tiffin then went on a 13-2 run to take a 26-19 lead at the half. Then the second half trailing by 10, Clarion won on a 13-6 run led by sophomore Emma Fickle who had three threes to pull Clarion within three, 48-45. However, Tiffin would pull away to a double-digit lead with three minutes to go and would take the game 65-51. Fickle led Clary with 18 points and two steals. The Golden Eagles were out-rebounded 44-30 and only had eight attempts at the foul line, where Tiffin had 28 attempts. The ladies will travel to Eastern PA this weekend to take on Kutztown Saturday and East Stroudsburg on Sunday. Tip-off for both games are at 3. The Golden Eagles men's basketball team opened up their season's their home schedule last night against Holy Family, where head coach Ron Ryder was looking to earn his 400th career win. The Tigers lit it up shooting 61.8% from the floor and shooting an outstanding 63.2% from beyond the arc. This sparked a 29-7 run for Holy Family in the first half to pull out to a 47-34 lead at the half. In the second half, the Tigers never allowed the, the Golden Eagles to get any closer than 11 at 58-47. Clarion turned the ball over on their next possession, leading to another 7-0 run by Holy Family. Holy Family went on to win 88-65. Senior Paul McQueen led the team with a career-high 25 points, scoring 14 of them in the first half. The Golden Eagles will also be traveling out east this weekend at Kutztown Saturday and, on, and at East Strasburg on Sunday. Tip-off for both games is at 5. In national sports news, Duke basketball head coach Mike Krzyzewski earned his 903rd career win as Duke defeated Michigan State 74-69. Leading by one at the half, the Blue Devils went on a 20-1 run in the second half to pull out to a 61-41 lead with 9-17 left. Michigan State let, went on a late run to cut Duke's lead to five, but Duke would hang on to win. Junior guard Andre Dawkins led the Blue Devils with 26 points. With the win, Coach K passes his mentor Bob Knight as the winning as head coach in men's Division I basketball history. The two coaches shared a hug after the game, and Coach K just simply told his mentor that he loved him. That's a wrap of your Wednesday night sports. I'm Matt Catrillo, and have an eagle-tastic night.